All right, all right, all right. Today's an important day. The Golden State Warriors have been smoked by the Los Angeles Lakers on however many games they lost. I think it was five or six. Uh, and they are obviously the reigning champions. We all, them know, them, uh, we all know them good and well. And um, the entire team folded. Klay Thompson had one of the best seasons of his career up to this point, although the stats aren't accurate in this because start today doesn't work. Jordan Poole, courtside or not courtside, he was not balling. It didn't matter. I think Andrew Wiggins missed like the last two months of the season because his dad passed away, so RIP. But I, I, I don't even know how he played in the playoffs. All I heard was criticism for Poole. Draymond's going to give you his 5-5-5 five, five and five a game. Looney was one of the greatest rebounders of all time in round one, and then they actually stopped even starting him at certain points. I, I forget why. Also, I'm live on Twitch right now. The chat isn't on the screen because I'm not supposed to have him on the screen the first minute because I don't know why. I think it's a YouTube like unwritten rule or something. And Andre Guadalo is supposed to retire. And then he tweeted out today, just no. He just tweeted out no. I'm about to make sure that's exactly what he tweeted. Andre, he, he just said no. Why does he tweet in such crypt? Why do people do this? And the chat's currently reminding me that yes, people on Twitter and everything are saying that the dynasty is over. I don't care. They could have 10 seconds to advance ball from the court. You could have that rule. Who cares? The Nets got the first overall pick. Thankfully for them, the Suns did not take it. Who the hell? I don't even know who these people are. Oh, I know Patrick Baldwin is. Who the hell is Ryan Rollins? Ryan Hollins? I, it feels like so weird rebuilding this team though. Cause well, yeah, obviously I didn't have to rebuild them last year because they won. It feels unethical to be trading some of these players. I mean, Jordan Poole, I really don't care what you've been in for like three years of relevance, but why would the Spurs trade the third pick? Would that be a smart idea? They already, okay, so in this game though, and I know I haven't talked about him yet, but Kuminga does usually end up pretty good. Um, I'll probably put him back at small four. It's not a six foot seven power four. I'm going to just do that right now. Never mind. No, I'm not actually. No, I'm not. Draymond also. He's definitely an accept his player option. He might have to go. He'd be, he be talking about, he likes LeBron a little bit too much. I don't know, man. I might send him to the Lakers. All right, and obviously um, to the YouTube people, you could pull up and watch the streams you ever feel like it just to watch me sit here and, um, you know, uh, contemplate the trade trades for longer than I do in the video since I just usually just cut to me doing the trade and I don't waste your time. I usually don't do this, but I'm literally looking through teams like what would be a player that fits the Warriors because I just I feel like it has to be meticulous. Why are you spamming Anthony Davis? A D A D O D O. Yeah, let me just pull some trickery, some magic to pull that off. How the hell would that be possible? Let's get Julius Randle. Yeah, this is probably equal. The thing is, is I've done so many rebuilds. I don't feel crazy about trading for almost anybody. But like, just for now, I need to find someone unique. So someone new. And Garland smoked his right kneecap. And you know what? I think I'm thinking I'm going for the spin master. I might, I might go for him right now. Uh, Lloyd Markin is not a bad option either. I feel a little more evil doing it though, because like the Jazz are actually using him. I think Pascal makes the most sense. The, the Raptors are probably looking to trade him this season. How how bad is his three points? Oh, 77? Just shoot better than 30%. Why are you that trash? I don't understand. You know what? I'll take the younger option. Give me Laurie and to, to rationalize it because it's Danny Ainge, give him a second round pick he loves those trading gp2 yeah who the hell cares it's gary payton I don't, I don't i don't care i know they traded like five second round picks for sadiq bay or no they got five and then they traded five for, i don't know what they did they did something weird they, they pulled some sorcery i mean if they'll, if they'll take it I, I do not want robert covington either if they'll take this i'll do it a first round pick for walker kessler but that's loony though you know what this isn't league defining and the jazz probably gonna suck anyways screw it um first round wait what first round pick did i trade shoot it wasn't this year's i'll do it screw it yeah this realistic or not how how realistic can you really keep when you're trying to rebuild a team with a bunch of 30 year old men who can't succeed trade the worst shooter ever steph curry all right let me time out this guy for an hour don't put blasphemy in my face i think i did 60 seconds instead of 60 minutes well i guess i'll be back yeah also laurie i already know they got his shot tendency cook we're not uh yeah we don't need to be the future buddy we don't got anybody else here to do that also put him at power forward draymond is cooked i'm not bringing Dr draymond will be gone within 10 minutes gotta revitalize things around here it's not working anymore probably got a mickey mouse ring in 2022 i'm sorry i'm just being honest oh should steve kerr hmm i'll get give steve kerr one year to consider his life all right let me let me make sure i time this out this guy correctly this time he said draymond would be irrelevant how did you spell irrelevant with an e at the beginning it's not it's not sounded out there we go i timed out for a thousand seconds this time how many minutes is that bull for john collins who says no god god csb you should know better than this forget the draft pick just pick with the 20 some pick i think ray john rupert smoked me in the last video so i'll take him this time he could be the clay replacement they just talked about him going to the free agency moses moody i completely forgot about him draymond accepted his player option yeah, not for long. How much money could this team have? Let me go to free agency. Cap space. Negative. Oh, yeah, I forgot. This is the they pay more people than anybody. No, I forgot. I wow. There goes John Collins right on cue. Ben. Yeah, that's definitely that's a thought. Why is there like a really intrusive thought in my mind that wants to trade Paul George? <laughs> <laughs> he always gets so much worse so fast. That's the only reason keeping me from doing this. By the way, I'm hypothetically speaking to my own conscience. I don't care what the chat says. Yeah, I I'm, I'm gonna go get him. I'm gonna go get Oguagua. I seen him in the trade finder. I I'm gonna I'm probably finesse this somehow, but Draymond for OG. Okay, not Kuminga. Hell no, no way in hell. Otto Porter back? Otto Porter revenge store? You know, I I'll take the risk. DiVincenzo and uh, Gary Payton from Boucher and Otto. I'll do it. OG for Draymond. Get this bastard OG up, up on his shooting tendencies because he. why is Wiggins a 65? 
I have never seen Wiggins only take 65% of his shots in my life. I guess maybe he's a little more tame on the Warriors. Omega, we don't need a big step up from you, buddy. All right, right so I traded Poole, so there's no longer a backup point guard. And sadly, OG can't do that. I think that's the, that's the only thing really needed right now, though. Uh, we got enough big men. This would be cute, wouldn't it? Seth, Steph. I'm not going to do it, though. Give me Mike Conley. I want a real basketball player, not a brother who made it because of his name. I'm just joking. I know Seth makes like 45% of his threes. Give me Boogie. Bring Boogie to the team. Minimum contract. Mike Conley and Boogie. Welcome. A real basketball player shows Mike Conley. Yeah, the most like... Actually, I can't even... Because now I'm mad that Mike Conley made an all-star team. Because now I'm going to be mad if CJ McCollum ever makes one. I know I talk about this all the time. But the fact they gave Mike, Mike Conley a Mickey Mouse all-star game and when he didn't deserve it is like, you know, like if, if they don't give, do that for everybody, I'm holding everybody the same standard, you know? Screw it. We could sign Seth too. Why not? I don't even know if we have any roster spots, but I'll take him. I don't think we do, but screw it. I'm still going to take him. I'm a Grizzlies fan. Mike Conley on the Warriors. Please, anything that but that i can't watch it buddy you guys didn't do anything for him anyways i mean he's the leading scorer why is mike conley the leading scorer all time of a franchise let's really talk about it and actually that's the that's another rebuttal to the other dude's comment why are you talking trash about mike conley he's the leading scorer of a franchise clay's an 84 kuminga's an 81 him og i guess wiggins kessler Lori. that's like the new era of this team i guess we're just gonna need to find another guy that's as good as this guy for when he falls off inevitably oh screw it since we, we need a roster spot i just wanted to go trade this young bastard who didn't get any better ryan rollins but they offered me wish rain ish wainwright and nothing else i don't want no ish Wayne, right? The starting lineup's the same, plus Laurie and Walker Kessler, so it's really not the same at all. I just entirely lied to you. And OG, Mike Conley, Kuminga, Boucher. That sounds about right. I'll throw a, I'll throw Otto in there so that everybody doesn't die because we know how the injuries are. Hey, Clay will resign. 15 million. He's probably worth this. You know what? Let's go two years. I don't know if I'm gonna keep you around, but I'm not stupid though. You're Clay Thompson. You probably always have some value. So we'll go. I'll go three year extension. Screw it. Yeah, won't work. Yeah. So Chad's talking about Clay lost his whole bag and he sucks and all that stuff. So I was just talking to Double D yesterday. And he was telling me that Clay had his best season of his career this season. So you're wrong, but equally, um, probably deserves all the criticism in the world for having like the worst game of all time in in game six too. Triangle offense would go nuts. I'd rather, man. You know what? I won't say what I'd rather do. I guess this team could win another ring. OJ. Oh, Kenobi might be the missing piece to anybody's championship, even though he had appendicitis when the Raptors won it, so he didn't even have contributed to that whatsoever. I always remember that OG had appendicitis because I almost had it when I was a kid. I thought I did. I went to the hospital and they were like, no, you're just stupid. Well, I didn't think I had it. Like, imagine like being like a seven-year-old and be like, mom, I have appendicitis. How would you know what an appendix is? I, they, I went to the hospital and they thought I had it, but then they were wrong. Who you got winning the, winning the chip? I got the Nuggets winning the chip. Because I'm a stand of Jokic. I don't know why I doubted them and said the Suns would beat them. I mean, because they have KD. Like, the thought is like, okay, yeah, they're overpowered. They have Kevin Durant of the Suns plus Kevin Durant plus the guy who's averaging like 35 in the playoffs. But we got a solidified all-star starter. Anybody else? Julius Randle's here, of course. You know, greatest player of all time. Oh, Jenna, no, be okay, yeah, you're going to be here for a minute. So we could re-sign you. Three-year deal. Take his money away. And we are the best team in the conference, 40 and 13. I mean, I'm not like ultra surprised. You know, they also have like a top 10 player of all time sitting right here. Jonathan Kuminga. Oh, yeah, I still have the subs on auto i entirely forgot about that thankfully though i don't i think the injury you know strategy has been working nobody's got injured yet so that's good Steph is playing like mediocre for his own standards but i'm pretty sure these match like his 2015 mvp numbers so you know times just change boogie started two games i mean walker that is insane boogie boogie starting two games is pretty funny he's shooting 34 percent from the field straight three pointers he wants to be a splash brother so bad you know what side i'm going to already know uh anybody in the negatives auto porter we'll be all right you're at the end of rotation you don't really do anything anyway but I could trade him for a pick. You know what? Yeah, dude. Actually, no, no. I got a better idea. Oh, yeah. This this is exactly what I was talking about. Screw it. I'll take Nick Richards from the Spurs. Jay Rich, if you want to ever, you know, sub in and play one minute a game. Uh, we need a better backup center. So that works. That's true, actually. Wait. This. Oh, yeah. Boucher. Well, Boucher's a four. Oh, dang. I changed Kuminga to a three, and they immediately started him over Wiggins. Is he just better? Honestly, he might be. 53% and 43 from three is pretty wild. I don't even think Kuminga's really playing in the playoffs for them. How would Draymond... You know, that's a good question. That's a good... See, uh, that's the first time I've looked at the chat and been like, wow, that, that is of something substantial that i that is how is jordan Poole doing he's probably doing great honestly um same as last year i guess a little bit worse from the field where did i even trade great draymond the raptors my god he is in hell oh he's injured high left ankle spray he got traded again he did the serge Ibaka, the raptors orlando in the same season i mean what what, what do you want to see from draymond really he's averaging four less assists probably because he doesn't play at all he's he was first he was behind pascal now he's behind paulo change Giannis's hair oh yeah sure why not um what what what's the change i'm looking for the change 
change. Where's the, you know, I'll change it anyways. Steph sprained his right toe. We'll be all right. He's already back. Look at that. He's a dog. Oh, he got his rookie cut. What do, what do you want me to do? Go and bring the Clippers out? I, I can't do that. I, I have two options. Jokic, hello. 64 wins. We're the best in the conference. Oh, Jokic left knee tendonitis. That makes the, the West easier. And then Bede makes the East easier. So that's, that's tough, I guess. Any All-NBA? I don't think Steph made an All-NBA team, but Julius Randle did again. Once again, fraud and out. Regular season, man. We had not one player win anything despite being the best. The 10-man rotation is good. You know, Nick Richards is not much of a liability compared to Otto Porter, Will Chamberlain Jr. Oh, great. Clay immediately. Playoff start and he gets injured. We should be all right, though. OG, I know he's going to start. Or we lose the next two games without Clay. 3-2 and 4-2. Beautiful, beautiful. Memphis, the rivalry continues and Clay is back just in time. Draymond's not here anymore to talk and not do anything. So there's that at least. And we got marketing against Jaren. You know, Jaren just has like a very weird game. Like he, he's like, um, the way that I'm very confused when I watch Julius Randle play because he has like a 64 ball handling and dribbles like Kyrie Irving. Like Jaren will just like be dribbling, but like nothing too crazy and then just like put up a really weird hook shot and it'll work and it'll average like 18 a game so maybe Laurie Markin it could be tall and stop that also we have Walker Kessler to guard the paint so you know just finesse the jazz screw the jazz I guess for this video actually yeah we took Mike Conley to wait yeah he was on the jazz before I'll take it I'll t oh my god I, I guess I won't wait yep yeah we are we, we still are okay cool three point win oh Jan and Obi leader of the team let's see who's got dog that's what Walker Kessler could not have shot for his life either can mark it and we just shouldn't have got people from Utah probably got like Mormon blood in them Moses Moody get up and play how did you get injured he doesn't even play how do you get a sore left knee and you literally do not play? he got it at practice didn't he he's not he's one of the worst players on the team currently for now and the lakers rematch yet again lebron colby jones d'angelo they re-signed him ad they lost reeves they lost Re wait he might just be injured honestly yeah no he's gone where did austin reeves go he is a new orleans pelican they won the first game we won the second one most moody wow we were really missing your presence buddy three one are we gonna blow a three one to lebron again oh oh jen and Obi. severe left ankle sprain season Definitely needed that. That's an awful loss. That sucks. How did Lori Markin get injured? When did you get injured? Sore left ankle. Why does it, bro, just get up? I don't understand. Why did they keep getting sore? Okay, Josh Richardson, yeah, you could replace OG for two seconds until we needed him back. I don't know what's going on. Game seven. Injuries. When did he even get injured? The Lakers suck, I guess. Couldn't score a point. Almost blew a 3 1 lead. I'll take it though. NBA Finals back again. And oh, what did Jonathan Kuminga do? Oh, 31 points. Career high, I would assume. That's what they were talking about. Beautiful, beautiful. Warriors versus Cavs rematch. Except we just smoked LeBron. It's just a dick. Chris, wow. Darius Garland. I think the last video too, the Knicks one that we just did like 24 hours ago. Um, I think Darius Garland got smoked in there too. And he's already got smoked in back to back season. Broke his kneecap and broke his left thigh. How do you even, I guess, yeah, that makes sense. Kind of. We'll go simcast for everyone. Yeah, this one's over. We lost. Game one is game one his reps wiggins five for 14 nick richards didn't miss a shot walker how why is he shooting so much he takes threes that's the issue i think i traded for him before and i'm like why why do you take threes he's got the greg odin disease that's what he's got stop taking threes you're a 67 overall three-point shooter I, I don't understand cut that out we don't need that from you you're holding yourself back get inside uh deandre aiden you know it'd be the opposite we're telling him you know go what is this why is it a hundred shot mid-range center tendency who cares get the nuggets rebuild ready you know that'd be in like two weeks now there's anything to get ready we are getting smoked oh my god we're not getting smoked 42 to 23 second uh third quarter that the warriors their third the third quarter used to be their thing i don't know if it still is but when they smoked the rockets that one year or every single it was bad like that was the worst i've ever seen it personally when they were playing that rockets the team that that missed 27 straight threes curry had a full triple double 11 rebounds and everything led the team in every single stat my god what a dog and donovan had 47 but it didn't matter because chris dunn is his starting point guard why are we losing to chris dunn this was pretty close but not close enough 33 and 11 from steph again the dog is going to carry us to another finals it, never mind um walker kessler broken ankle nick richards got a start was he already on the bench was walker already benched two of our offseason acquisitions though smoke hey well they already had nick starting over him for the last few games I'm pretty sure he didn't get benched once the whole season but all right i guess they're preparing for this moment somehow they knew he was gonna smoke his ankle okay i'm jumping in 136 left if i wasn't to move my camera right now it, it would be the chat's fault because I have a live chat telling me what to do at every moment and second, but thankfully I did. They need a playoff injury because players play through injuries once the playoff starts. Yeah, I don't think you can play through a broken left ankle. Donovan pulls up, off, rebounds Steph. 122 left. Steph back up the other way. Stefan, the pass down. Kuminga, close shot. Floater, good, ugly, really ugly shot. And Donovan Mitchell gets a charge drawn by Steph Curry. He is in his bag. Play Thompson back into the game. That could be good or bad, but I mean, to be fair, what was who was in? Like, uh, oh, there goes Laurie in the corner. Look at Mark. Steph trying to cook, guarded by Chris Dunn, who 
one time average like three steals per game i'm pretty sure steph is tired as hell steps back where is he going oh baseline curry back out marketing marketing to wiggins six seconds left the screen by clay thompson the left side uh, wiggins back back out clay open for three clay thompson how is clay kuzma oh kuzma was on the Cavs the last the, the next video he keeps going there mitchell pull up mid-range that is good they take the lead clay thompson sells us out again wide open three i know the catch wasn't magnificent but uh yeah he, yeah he sold he did so clank thompson that is cr that's crazy that clay is so good that nobody's ever called him clank thompson wow i've never seen that before seconds left curry what the hell oh my god that is awful mitchell back up the other way they're, they're about to foul kuzma's probably a good person to foul though i don't know if he's good at free throws i feel like he'd be goofy enough to miss one nope he greened it the pass into anybody any day now curry curry uh, 24 seconds left curry goes left all the way to the back out wide open kuminga oh my he hit straight nothing i feel like i have to do this once that like this is insane but he missed the rim kuminga you're, you're supposed to be the future of the team what the that jump shot is disgusting though no way his his jumper does not look like that right that is that's bad that's very bad um yep we uh well the series is tied i mean we might still win but it's it's tied it's no no ifs ends or buts about that oh my god curry had that layup no he did not <laughs> was he was he not driving into evan mobley two seconds left no way okay cool uh, marking ends out for the season dog we didn't have we literally had like three injuries the whole season the whole season now kuminga is starting at the four with wiggins it's it's literally last year's lineup but but looney's not here it's that's it it's just the same lineup draymond's not here either i don't it's oh, we lost every single player we traded for oh my god smoked in the first we needed marketing okay hold on comeback season come no never mind 47 from donovan i'm pretty sure i have clay on him it doesn't really get better than that hell OG's injured so um yeah oh time to lock in i guess uh, oh yeah oh seth curry's playing minutes dang you actually shot pretty well but no not happening moses moody too you haven't hit a shot yet so cut it down oh my god the, the whole bench is so depleted honestly i might let moody play minutes and nobody else I'd like you have some dog it's the last game of the season nothing else stakes on the line moody you know what you were drafted here we'll, we'll leave you in the rotation screw it uh boucher down there conley trust you a little bit but for the most part run them to the ground even if you, you die i mean that's literally what they did with clay clay was out for another two years because he got injured in the finals i don't even know why i'm playing nick richards as much i mean i don't have another center except for boucher so i guess that's why throw, throw, throw moody the last two i am terrified Cavs warriors game seven kuminga gotta have a draymond game oh my god yeah i think the benches came in because we just lost okay oh my god yep it's over with everybody on the bench everybody injured that i just even put my time into the golden state warriors 39 points nine rebounds 11 assists and look at that nobody told me to move the camera back i told you these guys have no purpose you can't even see the names of the players i'm talking about all right 39 to 9 11 from uh steph curry kuminga 25 5 and 5 clay thompson 15 whatever oh my god you are so corny change steph's number okay ban dq yeah no you are gone for life holy hell shut the hell up you could have kept the same roster well no i don't, I don't think we would have been in the, in the finals but i mean we got lucky we're also playing a, a, a mickey mouse oh i didn't even realize i didn't finish it there you go Steph. obviously finals mvp even though you know we could have given it to someone real random like um josh Richardson or something this time around also i just realized Iguodala is gone this is so sad to look at though why why are you why do you have to get injured how are the stats i would say steph carry but he really didn't clay still y'all talking about clay gotta go clay was playing great look at that Lloyd marking in 16 points per game we made up for that somehow wiggins kuminga yep beautiful okay and walker look at walker kessler's field goal percentage oh my god all because he was shooting threes the whole playoff that was our starting center also moody you shot kind of trash but the 12 points helped us win this game so i appreciate it and mobley folded again no nope, we sent this guy into retirement is dre in the chat yeah sorry hey they're over well, we sent this guy too he went back to the cavaliers just in his blood or something Gennaro pargo was a coach i remember this dude from the bobcat what i've no wait i knew he was a coach i'm stupid i'm lying i should have signed dwight howard and got him another ring increase the luxury tax oh you know the warriors are approving that one bonus um that doesn't really sure whatever the thing is though is that it's not even like i'm like led by a 28 year old star where i can like ride out the greatness for a bunch of years sure steph can't leave i don't think clay can leave after playing that well oh, mike conley is dumb old too oh my god this team is old okay mike conley shot sub 40 percent from the field chris boucher you're not really needed either i might get them i might try and trade them for some, young, some younger players oh my 
say cool what do i look like i need some self-respect around here point guard please you know i might just try and sign a better one they did just increase the luxury tax why are they offering clay for say cool i don't understand what what do they think doom boy yeah has the value of i'm getting ptsd from that 2k18 rebuild because every time i'd click a player and put them on the trade finder they'd come to my office pissed off thank god that does not exist in this i would never have a team chemistry you know i won't take take winning a ring for granted we're gonna uh man can you guys get uninjured any day now but um i'll, I'll keep the team the same for now do we have any draft picks gotta keep the team fresh though let's finesse the trailblazers again they love to get finesse all right i've literally I, I literally can't trade for a pick unless i trade one of my role players so screw it forget the pick oh steve Kerr, you proved yourself you'll be around for life i guess until you sell me out in three more years yeah you know what's crazy they fired monty williams state of the suns and four out of the last five head coaches got fired um except for tom thibodeau he's the only one he's the only one to not get fired so far is walker kessler gonna be injured for another season or something why does this guy still have a broken ankle i mean just you know save it fix it i don't know and they want to get rid of moses moody nah man he was playing integral parts in our uh, you know championship part and who i don't even know what this patrick baldwin diet guy does are, are you all right screw it we'll keep him around 13 players on the team i said i needed a better point guard because mike conley's old as hell just sign the best players available malik already have og oh there goes draymond i might have to i might have to do it honestly you know what no give me inexpensive jordan pool I think I think that'll be the best one. Uh, Tyus Jones, though, you know, he, he fits the Mike Conley mold and he's not that old and he shoots way better from the field. I'll, I'll take Tyus Jones. Screw it. You want to come to a real winning franchise like the Warriors. We did just smoke the Grizzlies. Oh, then we're getting rid of Seth. I mean, I got Seth the ring at least. I don't really care. We don't need you anymore. I'll sign Draymond if I can. If they don't, if you don't have the money for it, goodbye. Yeah, see you, Draymond. We don't need you. I do have one roster spot, though. Give me a um an old Warriors. You know, is Kavan out here? Is Kavan Looney? Oh, Wiseman. Wait, we can't afford Wiseman. Or oh, Eric Pascal. He was a cool dude he was supposed to be fake draymond that one year when everybody was injured that gets a little bit worse clay's an 82 he probably won't even start this season hopefully og can hold it down got an 84 three-point shot not as close walker kessler still injured and mike conley did get worse so i think it was a rightful signing i can now trade mike conley for a second round pick since, since we don't really need him anymore oh he is still starting they still and walker kessler's healthy again thank god also i, sh I shortened the rotation way too much honestly let mike conley and tyus jones play alongside it. dang they neither one of them have a shooting guard tag i'm gonna just trade mike right now screw it yeah screw it i don't even care if a point guard gets it try and get some worse players in a pick oh that might work screw it i'll take the two first from new orleans just in case zion gets ever gets injured i'll take it we'll throw rajon rupert in there as the 11th man for the season so nobody gets somebody no nobody dies nobody dies lloyd marketing loves us so much he already wants to resign he knows he couldn't win a ring anywhere else probably that's not even a shot really we're just good steph still steph is like actually considering leaving that's pretty funny and then sign a uh, sign a mediocre point guard to, just in case anybody gets injured oh uh he's he's a little bit not mediocre enough uh, oh, snap. Wow. Is that Frank Nilakina? Well, I didn't see him there. Yeah. Uh, four year deal. Th three year deal. Three. Accept it. There you go. It's just whenever you don't say anything, it's quiet as hell. Yeah, it's kind of how it works when you don't say anything. And that's crazy. I just got, I just noticed that I ratioed Stephen A. Smith. 27,000 likes to 21,000 likes. That's kind of sad. He said he wanted Damian Lillard like an idiot. Yeah, great. Him and Jalen Brunson, six foot one backcourt. That'll be real smart. We just smoked one of those in the first round. You know, it's funny you say, who would you want for Randall? I was actually on the, uh, first of all, him, he's not going to get traded, first of all. Secondly, if any, the, the soonest he would get traded is probably next year's trade deadline if things went wrong wrong and it, I, I was looking at all like the trades that could happen. Honestly, I don't know. I saw CSBs in here. He's gonna be pissed off at me. But I, I was thinking maybe the Pacers, uh, if they wanted to give us like some scrubs, really, because like that's the thing. People are like, oh, you're gonna trade Randall and you're gonna get Carl Towns. No, you're gonna get Ian Jackson or um, uh, 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 Jalen Smith. Like someone, you're gonna get like two mediocre players and two picks or something. People are realizing that Randall's frauded out. Tobias Harris, yeah, all right, buddy, over my dead body. Siakam, Siakam dropped fifty on us this season not trading for julius randall i mean they did miss the playoffs too though giddy in a second you are cracked out if you think the thunder would trade giddy for randall also does steph curry still like this team will he resign he will resign screw it we'll go three years the thing is thankfully he doesn't get much worse in 2k so just give him and i am i am stealing from him i'll be honest with you stealing and wiggins wow he wants no money like mr Krabs out here with the money we're giving these players boucher you're cool you could have a four year. Now nah, go three year minimum. There you go. Randall and quickly for Beal. Oh yeah, that'll that that'll really save us, huh? He's been doing a lot. Of, he's been doing a lot in Washington, hasn't he? He's a lot of championships. Does anyone know how to change a draft class mid season? Go to prospect scouting and click load slash download draft class. Don't be stupid. Come on, you got it. I'm just kidding. I actually thought about that yesterday. I'm like, dang, people probably Clay Thompson broke his nose. Just put on a mask. 60 wins. We are 15 wins better than anybody in the conference. Season's about to end. Boss of the Kings though, they still own us. Darius Garland wins MVP. That's crazy. So oh Brian. 
Ronnie Ronnie James was rookie of the year. Aswa, six men. Victor. Victor's on. Oh, yeah, he is on the Nets. Wow. Which will not happen in real life. They do not have a pick in the lottery, but screw it. You know what? I'll, I'll take the variety. JB Bickerstaff, coach of the. Oh, wow. Okay. So the Cavs are better than us. LaMelo, ruptured right Achilles for the season. Yep. Goodbye to that career. You and Lonzo. Them injuries, man. Jesus. That ball family. What was LeVar feeding him? With all due respect. Um, I think. Okay. No, Markinen's back. Okay. Everybody's healthy. That's good. 11 men. We can run. We can go 10 man rotation, I guess. I mean, we have been winning a lot of games. Actually, you know what? No, keep it 11 for the first few rounds and then maybe switch it back. Hopefully, okay. Oh, okay. See, it's pretty good. We might actually, we, we could get smoked by them, but I don't think we will. 2-2. Two, two. Oh, this might be it. 3-2. Two. 4-2. Two. I'll take it. Second round, Houston. How are they looking these days? Did they sign anybody yet or anybody great? Just Jalen and Jabari Smith. Honestly, we should be good against them too. The Warriors always owned Houston back in their heyday. Now they got a whole new star shooting guard. 4-1. And Memphis. Ty, Ty Jones, bruised rib. He'll be all right. Stay in the rotation. He'll, he'll live. He already, he already healed. He, he, I, I gave him words of motivation. Josh Hart would be a solid grit and grind play. Oh, um, I think I see a, a bit of a difference with their starting lineup. Yeah, I, I don't know. Uh, I don't think the guy on the left is anywhere present. And they might have made it, you know, rotational change or the more likely case that, you know, he, he uh, I write Uncle Sprang two to four weeks. Warriors playing an injured Grizzlies yet again. And they won a game. He, he could have came back. Maybe not. Probably not. Oh, we're getting the rematch. Walker, get in the rotation. Okay. Um, Sengun. Tatum, Brown, Brogdon, and Isaiah Stewart. That's not Horford, but I, I guess. Okay. Clay also isn't starting currently, but that's fine. I, I never changed the rotation to a 10 man, did I? Let me see how the players are playing in the playoffs. It'll tell me if I do anything. Did you say Michael the Mouse to ring? You are so stupid. Um, mm, Everyone's playing pretty well. You know what? Screw it. We'll, we'll keep it pushing. Game one, Celtics. Hello. Oh my God. Oh, don't lose it now. They almost lost it. Don't hit a three. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. 24 points. Kuminga leads the team. Our, uh, you know, our prodigy or whatever. Walker Kessler is still an inefficient shot chucker, even now. Like, even after I took away the three-pointers. Five for 11 as a center. That's not that bad, actually. I'm lying. Oh, now he's healthy as well. Yeah, letting up 152 points probably isn't a good thing. Um, Jalen Brown, 33. Didn't we, like, trade for, like, seven defensive players, you know, to not allow this to happen? They have Clarkson on the bench, too. 19 and 17 minutes. That is a cheat code. What? How do they... Oh, and they still have Smart? They changed it. Did they... Was he not starting? He, he's, he is not starting. They got one hell of a bench over there in Boston, always doesn't even make sense oh my god what a comeback into nothing eight for 21 from brown and they are from tatum which actually isn't that bad and they still scored 137 points curry only took 11 shots that's not good you know i'll make it a 10 man for now you know what we need to hit a shot quite possibly save our season so i'm gonna jump in we're up by two with 40 something seconds left 48 okay and look almost didn't change that camera but i just told you the exact score oh Jenanobi, the passing is that tyus jones in the game right now screw it into tyus jones jones goes baseline he is not going to take the shot though I ha maybe he is oh my god he did rebound by kessler oh walker kessler he puts it why did he go up why did he go up brogdon back down the other way brogdon all the way and he's gonna dunk over the defense and take the tie the game up 125 steph curry crosses over twice steps back for three it is off steph curry sold again crackhead oh crackhead man meth curry oh marketing's in good yeah, I don't know what that means for defense, but screw it. Tatum guarded by Kuminga, our fake savior that airballed the three-point shot the last time I jumped to a game. I honestly forgot all about that. Brogdon trying to get open on the left side. He will not. Tatum's going to take the last shot. More than likely three seconds left. Tatum with enough room to hit it, and he bricks the hell out of it. It is overtime. Oh, my God. Everybody sucks. Hey, he did the sidestep. Could have ended our series right there, but he sold. Let's see. Do we got it in the sim? We got it, right? I think so. Yeah, we got it. Okay, cool. I'll take it. 2-2. Two, two. My God. Laurie marketing 37. Where's the Corgi when you need it man thankfully nobody got injured they want less minutes for clay and more for wiggins well i didn't do it so the gameplay has been really stupid and kind of funny so skirt we're in here again uh, i'll take the shots three shots oh my god he didn't even green that 97 percent still pretty good though you know I'll take those three mickey free throws tatum sidestep stops moving entirely gets the screen from mr stewart lebron's biggest enemy and he passed it down to stewart beautiful pass for the layups i don't know why stewart went up with the grace of a prime george gervin steph curry to the basket back out market wide open OG Ananobi, corner three. He bricks it. Oh, look at Kessler for the rebound. He goes up again. And he may. Yo, Kessler be shooting the shots, man. Number 43. Who else? Wore Pascal wears 43, right? Screen. Tatum pulls up over Kessler. An awful looking shot. He misses. And the screens for Clay Thompson. He doesn't get open. Curry's got Robert Williams on him. Will he take advantage of the size advantage? Curry fade away. He misses again. Kessler. Oh, my. Walker Kessler. I keep thinking to call him Kessler Edwards. Curry's trying to get. Oh, the Curry play. The Curry play down to Edwards. And he gets flaked 
flagrant foul? Shooting foul, I guess. They didn't call the flagrant. That was a wild. They really ran a Warriors play. The corner screen set for him. Oh, he can't hit a free throw, though. Just a, a zero percent. Not a not a chance in the world. Okay, there and a hundred percent. That's a one hell of a turnaround. The last chance for the Celtics to take, uh, or I don't know, try to fend off a 3-2 lead being taken against them. Screen set. Sengun goes. Sengun to Brogdon open for three. That is off. Rebound by marketing and that is game. Play shot two for eight. So, you know, there goes his character. Walker Kessler, four for 12, but had, and only had six rebounds. We saw like three of the greatest ones of the game. I should have given less minutes to Clay Thompson. Yeah, I should have listened to them. But, you know, sometimes the art of deception is a good art, man. You know, it's pretty close, but screw it. We're up by three. We could we could fold. We could sell this game. It's been a nice finals. Good gameplay. Kuminga into Curry. Curry guarded by Marcus Smart. He's in the game over the uh, former six man of the year, Ma Malcolm Brogdon, who now isn't, I guess. Curry's in a fadeaway for three to end it. He missed again. Tatum back up the other way. Tatum, the pass down to Brown, and Brown will get the layup over Kessler. Steph Curry behind the back twice the curry slide i saw him actually doing in real life you know i mean that's probably where you know they got it from pass down oh lori marking in the beautiful cut to take the lead or take a three-point lead yeah tatum did miss a shot that would have had them up 3-1 that is crazy well he hit the one that'll keep them from losing the championship though the steps back between the legs he goes back out to the three-point line screen by isaiah stewart tatum gonna go to the basket and dunk it around lori marketing not bad just give curry the what why is ray john rupert trying to get the ball do not get there thank you what the hell why is ray john rupert even in the game okay you know what now he isn't i don't know what happened i guess every shooting guard fouled out or something because that was insane yeah let's uh why did curry because like usually they'll have like a big man swing the ball to a point guard because they can't shoot free throw but curry swinging the ball to rajon rupert can i check his free throw because that's insane he's got to be like the greatest free throw shooter of all time or something because why did that just happen 85 that's not doesn't seem moving curry's a 96 i don't get it curry the first one greens it i was about to say if he misses maybe he knew something maybe his hand hurts or something he green both no timeout celtics last chance one shot, one opportunity. He swings it up to Jalen Brown, who takes a shot right over Tyus Jones. That actually was kind of crazy. And he missed. So that's it. The Warriors are winning a championship in Boston. We're winning the rematch. And thankfully, nobody got injured this year because we probably would have lost if anybody got injured I, I i think that's it i don't know why i stood in i don't want to see the final celebration screw why not you saying yeah we did it we did it last season too back to back again now watch them blow the three-peat like they did irl oh yeah they did actually dang i, I was thinking of the 2016 one but i guess yeah 2019 they could have they could have done it 31 points with tatum and jordan clarkson was inefficient and andrew wiggins couldn't hit a shot but hey steph curry live love steph i mean yeah they could have had five straight but i mean now we're talking a little bit too hypothetical man this video shout out goes to silent magic underscore who said camera that's what i need the one person to say it i needed that oh i needed that i had someone tell me i felt like um here's the playoff stats they're good they play basketball sometimes repeat 3p real quick before steph retires we might not even have to go until 2020 30 like we usually do i don't know why i said 2020 30 and chris paul pack he went to the lakers and everything after lebron retired why would he do that probably because they give money Did they give money it says zero years zero dollars so i don't know mike conley's out of here good thing i traded him i'm sorry i couldn't get you the second ring and shout out to Brooke Lopez and Westbrook. Well, I've never taken this much time to shout out to people who retired. Goodbye, Terrence Ross. Oh, there goes like every casualty of Steph Curry's career. Westbrook, Chris Paul, Blake Griffin, almost all of them. Did we like finesse any? We didn't finesse a draft pick. I literally have no other picks except for our own. Oh, I lied. I have two Pelicans picks. I'm stupid. I think, yeah, I think it is about that time where I got to trade for a lottery pick. I think it's, you know, getting too late to not have one. I think the Boucher, I just saw one for Boucher. I think it was the, not the Blazers. Who was it? Thunder. Yeah, we, we could do this deal. I'll take the 13th pick and another future pick for Boucher in a first. So the 13th pick, anybody interesting here? Anybody good at basketball? Jason Azamoda is easily the best C plus overall. I might just take him and not overthink this. I don't, I don't think I've drafted this dude ever so screw it that works he is 31 years old i mean 21 years old but 74 honestly not that good but hopefully you are eventually we need a new clay i think i have to re-sign kuminga luca vildoza well i remember when he was on the knicks for negative 10 seconds if kuzma uh, uh kuzma kuminga did i say kuzma the last time i don't know it's because i said vildoza and then i confused myself bring moody back for a while too we're gonna need players eventually to play more minutes play's probably gonna be a 78 after the season look at frankie lakina man oh yeah i do need another power forward because we let what's his name go marvin Bagley? You want to be the next? Okay, no, you're an inefficient three-point shooter. Chris Boucher's here. I just traded you. How are you here? They released him. 
they released him immediately too that is crazy you want to resign that is hilarious is that even legal are you gonna he didn't even sign back you know what i would be pissed off a little bit too if that got I, okay understandable screw it i'll take robinson earl why not it feels mediocre but whatever oh never mind the jazz matched the offer sheet jonathan isaac feels like a good signing but he has the potential to mess everything up that's why you can't do that jalen johnson there we go we got him guys right, jones somehow got worse even though he's not that old clay is only an 80 now he is worse than ray john rupert didn't i say i had to draft a, a clay replacement and steph's a 93 but steph's not getting traded let's be honest until maybe it might have to say that he's literally retiring which i actually got to start checking for so wait does steph have six rings now i guess hypothetically oh no no they lost that's why i'm here i was about to say they could have won this year but they they can't i i forgot about that part we do not have a backup center right now i mean that is at least playing you know we'll just run a 12 man for now and then in the in the off season and the postseason i'll set it so that nick richards actually plays i'll just do that and also don't go any further who's re-signing come on welcome back to the team uh og yep i already got a re-sign i'm already re -sign him once clay's still thinking about it buddy we know you're not going anywhere dang you, you don't even know where the lineup screen is this dude is so new to hey look look don't worry i'm i'm, cre I'm doing a wholesome act for a young a young man who uh who does not know where the lineup screen is see what i just did boom 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 coach coach game plan click that yada yada bada bing there t t t tutorial step number one that is how you set your lineup in my league wow for all the viewers out there that haven't figured it out yet it sounds very condescending and i think that's just how i sound it, it kind of is it kind of is clay we already knew you were coming back steph is still not an all-star starter is steph not even here oh there he is okay i'm like there's no way you're a 93 overall and you're not here we are the best yet again was cat an all-star starter i did not see that that is insane og and anobi shooting 42 percent for some reason having a pretty i feel like he usually shoots at least 45 that's like yeah yeah that's that's a i mean hey you shot this the, the first year we won the ring so you know what he's just back to normal he was on a different level last year that's it nothing else really just look at him wiggins is 30 it's really weird i remember when wiggins was drafted you know that young man um, but he's not actually 30 so i'm not that old yet i think the day i'll feel old because the first draft i ever watched was when ad got drafted i'll feel old when ad like retires that's i mean i already do because he uh you know he's already pretty old wow og just broke his ankle on the last day of the season i clicked it as if like it was like you know like i don't know still march or something we had some time but that's that sucks that's a pretty bad loss steve kerr 66 and 16 a lot of sixes i'm kind of scared of you i left ankle sprain you honest zion left knee tendonitis i don't even know you know it's crazy actually i guess ever since i started using injuries i never see the pelicans do anything i feel like maybe a little bit before that as well but i don't be seeing them do anything in simulation they used to be, they used to be undefeated every time now it's like the thunder rockets why did we lose the first game to the grizzlies hold on also oh yeah i am running a uh 12 man rotation hold on cut that down honestly cut that down to nine and then put her i lied 10 men and put richards in there and we're good someone just came in here and said what's up guys i've been rising up woman what did i miss i need to i need to delete my account on this app so soon what was the trade with oh wait y'all answered the chat questions why am i talking to these people these heathens we lost the first two games we lost the first three games we have lost every game to the grizzlies that's that's uh this might be the end jaw's actually playing this time around he wants revenge for the for the uh whatever seed moses moody broke his nose how did you break your nose aren't you in oh you're, you're in the rotation wait that doesn't change anything does it even change his stats if you break your nose oh pass vision <laughs> pass accuracy speed how Wow, stamina oh i guess breathing maybe eh, i don't know we're gonna throw jalen johnson in the rotation for him everybody gets swept in the first round the warriors okay the warriors dynasty wasn't over but now it's probably over swept not even a game one after winning the ring is that's that's definitely that's definitely a concept right there playoff stats i'm scared to look at these lori marketing was pretty bad at, sh at shooting the basketball moses moody was tyus jones og didn't play i don't think og and nobody was the difference between not winning a game in the first round i don't understand what happened is it time to rebuild around kuminga is it time or do we run it back one more year since we won all these games i don't know this is nasty though i feel like like musty i feel like pig pen and the jazz the the jazz led by 82 overall greg dickey are the um the, yeah he, he won the what's it called the western conference mvp i don't know how this is possible sadiq bay zach zachary they're not even jordan pool jordan pools in the finals basically is what i'm trying to say he's the best i think he's the best overall player on this team and they blew a 2-0 lead to donovan but we would have beat donovan we already did once oh my god i'm gonna let the chat decide do i override this or let it happen there it is the poll is up me personally i'm voting in, in favor of my team override retirement let's see what happens farewell tour i did see someone comment that would be kind of cool the last dance steph curry edition we just lose in the first round and him retiring after getting swept in the first round is pretty sad all right uh that wins overriding the retirement it's official one more year with steph i won't trade him we'll, we'll try and go all out i guess i don't know anybody else oh draymond's gone we don't care you have many years the last splash 
please take that name back. Throw it in the bin, fam. Throw it in the bin. There go Paul George, the man I could have traded for like seven years ago. Oh, oh, we're pulling up to the Draymond Jersey retirement, man. It'd be real awkward after all the after us just losing to the Grizzlies, I guess. All star teams will be determined by the top vote getters. So just the fans. That's kind of interesting. I don't know how that changes anything in the like. I mean, the fans are literally auto generated. They don't exist in the game. Oh my God! And the Jazz got the first pick from that Minnesota trade after going to the finals. Logically, doesn't make any sense how they made it and we didn't, but we ball. Yeah, Steve Kerr will even overpay you a little bit. I know you just lost, but you won us two rings, so I can't get rid of you. Well, another two, I should say, in the simulation. Do I have to keep Clay around for Steph's last year? He obviously played pretty decent. OG's kind of selling me with those injuries, but he just, I, I'm over here looking at the real trade and Anthony Edwards trade and buddy in the chat talking about, yo, Scotty, Scotty. All right, dog. I already did uh, 15 points per game. Yeah, I might, I might have to do this, huh? Because Steph is getting old, right? I think he's averaging less and less points as the years go on. Marketing's a good, like, counter option, solid option, like fourth, third option, but not, he's not number one or two. Edwards is already a number one in his own team, so he would pretty easily fit into two on this and and the wolves suck i mean literally they we just matter of fact you guys want a second round pick you could have a second round pick instead of frank how about that oh it literally cannot work without frank wow um you know what that's the sacrifice screw it that's what makes it even you could have a second round pick and frank og and marketing i was thinking you know og be getting injured a little bit too much honestly i think i think i would rather keep him than Jaden mcdaniels as well but that's the sacrifice as well let me see would they would they do this without him oh no yeah no okay well we got to do it with them it would take clay though wait this but i wouldn't get Jaden mcdaniel i don't really need Jaden mcdaniel oh man should i do this i might have to sacrifice clay hey you know what i'm a, I'm a cold cut dry man i don't really care that him and curry are cool and they're friends you guys have six rings together yeah i'm gonna have to get clay out of here sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do laurie marketing for anthony Edwards and look a second round pick for um gerson rosas is that their dude I, I don't know they fire him they probably fired him that's probably i probably heard his name because they fired him I don't, or they or they didn't i don't think they did you know what just hold that second round pick. Anthony Edwards, welcome for the team. We definitely need a power forward now, though. That is one issue. I know that, you know, it sounds kind of pretty. I mean, to be fair, we do have a lot of like, like rough body wings that, that could play power forward. Like, I mean, I guess Wiggins could hypothetically. I feel like OG could. Look, see, that's what you're not telling me. Y'all know the camera is blocking the, oh, put up the wrong. That was a screenshot from yesterday. The camera, see, nobody talk, telling me about the camera. Like, we need the, we need, we need, I tried, didn't want to spam, then spam. We need, spam, spam. We need the, you know what I'm saying? We need to see who how good moses moody's doing why he's not that good and he's still a 79 overall why am i still talking wiggins and power forward seems that nice honestly not to me um i'm about to go trade for one trey murphy might be like the most perfect warriors power forward ever let me see if i get him for less he's still on the pelicans right oh but he doesn't even rebound he's barely even a power forward dang i thought he would fit better but we don't need another just wing that can't rebound you know i'll, I'll check out free agency in a second also uh and you have any draft picks 29th i can't get rid of it that sucks we drafted another yabu Sele. did anybody see when uh uh what's his name again uh Gershon Yabu Sele yeah yeah anybody see when he body slammed Dante Exum a few days ago or a few weeks ago whatever dang Jimmy Butler had a zero dollar play I don't think that's correct I've been bringing back this dude Patrick Baldwin every year for no reason he never plays is that Dylan Brooks he's a cool guy you know great player I was about to say I did see Bobby Portis on there Bobby Portis actually might be a good power forward for this team it doesn't really make sense but it kind of does oh Nas Reed short body center could play power forward not very costly how about you how about you come to this basketball organization? You shoot the three, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, pull up. There you go, Nas Reed, welcome to the team. And you know what, I'll, I'll make the mistake again. Patrick Baldwin. Actually, no one's probably gonna sign him. I get him for that other contract, but that'll probably cost more. Screw it, just a one year, who cares? Steph is still a 92. This is last season, only one year left. Anthony Edwards is here for the hell of it. Who knows, the wolves suck anyways. Oh no, Yabu Sele, sore left ankle for the season. He'll probably be back in two seconds. You genuinely think Brooks will be a Laker last season? Yeah, and I, I genuinely think you should see the door of a rehab if you think that's the case because why the hell would dylan why the hell would the lakers be the team to take a chance on him after what what is you know when un, underwent okay i will not be releasing frank oh marjan you can get off my team we have 16 players my god screw it i'm trading yabu sele i'll take some spurs picks over our picks oh that's an atlanta pick who cares curry edwards kuminga jalen johnson oh yeah i forgot i was even looking for a backup power forward i was looking for a starting one screw it nazareed starting power forward we'll see if it works i keep seeing nazareed propaganda on twitter which sounds really weird but it's not it's 
it's it's true we have mad small forwards my god i guess that helps too i hope they don't want to start nazarene anyways we ball it is what it is before no before curry's last season even starts package some of these mid players for a better player oh hello Kawhi. miles turner marvin bagley i might take this i might we don't have like screw it give me it i'm not gonna overthink it give me the trade get sadiq to break up the jazz that's pretty funny i didn't do it though i make miles a four we're playing big body lineups we're doing what the uh tim wolves did but successfully miles turner has finally been traded i know that guy's been mocked in trades for the past 10 years oh dang i was about to say what happened to our backup point guard i just traded tyus jones i'm an idiot jalen johnson for trade man done there's the lineup they're a little bit pissed off because i just made a bunch of trades at the beginning of the season hopefully um hey you guys want to still resign though no they don't like me right now business is business chill out go always have cpu adjust that stuff whatever today is a traded line dang where's the all-star oh, all-stars afterwards okay dang edward oh edwards is a player option that's why he doesn't want to resign T dang trade man's injured my god our only point guard except for the god frank Lakina, four-year deal minimum take it trey man probably wants less money right now because he's injured so we'll take advantage of that uh take this contract how did patrick baldwin get a no trade clause i i gave him a deal i did not give him a no trade clause you know what though he doesn't want to be here so maybe i can get this trade off how's the team doing second best the thunder already um what's it called clinch the playoff very still leading the team kuminga is second and edwards is third ogs shooting mid because everybody else is shooting plus 50 percent the system is systeming you know what he popped up again i'm gonna take it as a sign give me trey murphy from marvin bagley i'll take it and uh patrick baldwin he, he he waved his no trade clause look at that man wow oh no we got this guy oh god that name man what you got in game seven of celtics in philly this video will go up after that so it'll be even more awkward um i'll go celtics i'll go celtics Lamelo wins mvp marcus johnson rookie of the year trey johnson most improved mark dangle of this i still never know if i'm saying that right i think i am you said local philadelphian crying right now you know my friend one of my friends is a sixers fan my like my my best friend is a sixers fan and he uh uh, we were at basketball camp in seventh grade and he walks up to me and he's like yeah um I, I'm gonna pick the Sixers to be a team up because they're bad right now. So I, 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 you can't say I bandwagon when they're good. And honestly, that was the most respectable thing he's ever done. The last dance is over. Steph Curry is injured. I had no clue, and now I have a clue. Steph Curry turned the injury thing. I need to see when he comes back. Um, we're cooked. Trey Man is starting a point guard. Changes honestly don't change that. Just leave it. I trust Trey Man with my life. I guess not really. He only averages two assists. Never mind. Get him out of here. Put Edwards at point guard for now. He could play there. Not really, but I guess for now he can. Honestly, this is a pretty switchable, tall defensive lineup. So that's kind. It'll be kind of interesting. It's actually Jesus. I didn't realize how good the defense was on this team. Come back, please. Now we're playing the pelicans in the first we won the first game won the second game what is anybody in is zion injured the team just isn't that good ingram if he's still there then he's injured but who cares 3-1 Kuminga's out now for two weeks don't blow the 3-0 lead don't blow the 3-0 lead Kuminga's still playing okay good we didn't we didn't blow the 3-0 lead hey og i almost traded you a couple times but 23 points we'll take it san antonio second round brandon miller dj wagner justin edwards demontis Sabonis, aaron gordon pretty solid team 2-1 in their favor edwards has a sore back 2-2 two, two, he's been carrying the team that's why and 4-2 we're in the conference finals without Steph this would be a great time to return because we're playing the god tier thunder and you know we, we kind of need you Steph Curry slam poetry reading will be out four to six weeks how many more weeks day to day it's day to day shout out to Anthony Davis in one game we we lost two games we won three games he's back he is back and we won did he play that game he did 36 points in his return game still has a sore wrist still a dog come on Steph one more ring Kuminga, Curry, yep, healthy, great. Come on, Steph, chill out. Then we gotta run the 10 man. I'll, I'll bring down the bench utilization because, you know, forget him, forget the bench. You know, I'll cut out Trey Murphy for now, make it a nine man. Oh, it just went out the other way than I thought it would. Okay. Whoa. Oh, snap. They got Edwards on the bench. I did not realize that. You could play some point guard though because he was cooking. Um, yeah. What is this, game six? I also think I forgot to start Edwards again. Three minutes left. Okay. Yeah, I definitely forgot to do it. Hey, oh. It didn't. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Score. Score the basketball. Score the basketball. There you go. 133. Let's go. Our last chance, last opportunity. At the very least, it's more valiant than losing in four to the Grizzlies as a one seed. Is Trey Murphy in the game, even though I removed from the rotation? Okay. Who is that at center? Wait. Oh, that's Nas Reed. Double team. Nas Reed double team. Pass out. Wide open. Smith Jr. Brick. Nick Smith Jr. to be exact. And yeah, I did the little rotations thing. I think Edwards is playing because of that. Or maybe no. I think he's about to get subbed out. Whatever. Oh my God. Curry is cooking. Shea Curry to the basket and none. Guys, we're not calling this the last splash. That is not, that's not it. 
that's not the one it would actually be making a mockery of steph curry's life not even just his basketball career life oh nick smith again they take the lead one point lead for them that's a huge three with 57 seconds to go he pulled with no hesitation you know what? if curry hits a game one you could call it the last splash he passed the ball off though back to curry he gets it he said hey we're going out on my terms never mind to kuminga who airballed the shot like not too long ago kuminga five seconds left kuminga going nowhere back out miles turner for three our acquisition he misses he missed the shot and they're gonna foul within the next three seconds because the game wait maybe not oh my god that might have been better than foul honestly oh man we're cooked greatest three-point shooter ever 93 overall still three-point shot he's going to the basket he passed it out to thank god walker kessler does not shoot anymore is anybody gonna get out to this three-point line oh my god almost threw the ball away curry where are you going steph oh the step back three steph oh he missed it he just barely missed it but wait kuminga gets another shot he missed it too it's over it's over we got cooked but he just missed the craziest in and out in world history the last miss you know what that might have to be it man um yep we got we got cooked watch he doesn't even retire i remember i had one video where steph played till 50 right i think it was on 2k20 or 21 that game was tweaking out shay made both i don't want to see i don't want to see my demise we lost walker kessler led the team in scoring and steph shot four for 12 with 17 assists like a true ricky rubio game the golden state warriors have been eliminated from the Cavs win the ring evan mobley finals mvp steph we checked that player card buddy jover 39 years old and we now have to rebuild without steph curry yay i might go like two years and just give up honestly because we won two rings already oh man that's bad that's a bad look for the brand force another one buddy you don't know how this works uh what a, oh oh hold on league meetings approve automatic i'm not doing this i remember i did this once it was dumb it didn't even really work it didn't yeah it really didn't work it didn't work but i realized that when it says automatic points will not now be granted on shooting fouls it just means obviously shooting fouls not like bonus shots but then when i looked at the stats for free throws throughout the season it didn't seem like anything really changed like all the stats were still the same so hey it it might be time to rebuild rebuild though oh warriors v atlanta i like it i like it i like that oh we fell down to, really from five to eight that is very unlucky and guess who jumped up the jazz twice again we have a lot of very quality players i think though well, Okay, Walker Kessler is a lifer. That dude is a great rebounder. He has been fantastic. He will be here for a while. Oh, Miles Turner, you were like a one-year fake Steph Curry rental. If we get like the first pick or something off of Miles Turner, like finesse something like that, I will 1,000%. I'll turn off the Stipean rule. I do not care Well, if it doesn't let it trade. Okay, it will. It's the Jazz, though. The Jazz. Screw it. Just finesse the Jazz again. You could have a... a we took Walker Kessler. You could have another guy. Okay, not Frank. They have Dylan Brooks. They deserve this. Miles Turner for the first pick. Yeah, I didn't think that was going to work either. Okay, Frank will never get traded. Man maybe anybody else old where oh, i already traded clay we'll trade richards with him do that and throw in oh we got a good amount yeah 2031 warriors pick throwing them seconds probably 17th i like the picks i like the pick spread we got right now throwing um not thunder nobody else's pick can we throw on our own again yeah do come on come on hey man you know what we're on the warriors anyway i'm down to sac the frank sacrifice goodbye frank hey look sometimes you, you if you love him you gotta let him go he'll play minutes on the jazz they suck i'm an honest man you know you, you sometimes uh, you realize you're looking at a virtual tv screen and i need the first pick so we have the first pick in the draft is this the oh jamal mcknight the bonsta I'm, I'm probably gonna draft this dude we've been needing a power forward for a little while frank looks like asap rocky I mean, is, is his claim valid i want to say no i want to say no you you just you're just thinking about rocky because you saw a video of him on twitter today congratulating his daughter son I, what did what did they have i don't know on i think they had a son on his birthday maybe a little you know why do i tent why do i um give any yeah thought to this jason azamoda you were the 13th pick two years ago you better pick it up soon buddy trey murphy might gotta go too i know <laughs> another player i just tried no nah, i like you wait let me see how the our little uh okay oh wait right right i forgot about that okay edwards is probably just gonna play point guard honestly because i don't know how we're gonna get another point guard that good is there another point guard in the draft oh mcknight okay arenas too maybe I could play point guard try and get pick one and two i don't think i usually build off of this draft so that's kind of an interesting one to do so usually we have to rebuild way earlier into the video you know get the monster make sure we get pick one and two i want i mean not the monster mcknight and him i think i saw the blazers had it yeah get rid of the team oh yeah it, it's definitely og's time og you can go uh no not another pick though you could have pick 17 how about that pick 17 and another future first and just throwing seconds and i feel like this one should actually work this time around screw it just do trey murphy and og that should work right it works in, in about three seconds i'll give him the first as well 
whatever. There it is. All right, we got the second pick that too many picks, but screw it. There's a lot of good players in this draft. You got to, you know, Warrior, they're a powerful team, a, a very prestigious team. You got to keep them moving and grooving. Is Steve Kerr still here? I don't know. Screw it. You, 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 were, you were decent. The first pick in the draft. You know what? I'll take Jamal McKnight just to like crown him as the new Steph Curry. It'll be like a whole like, you know, article and everything. Then after that, I'll take the Bonsta, the unanimous number one overall pick after that. Caleb Holt. Can can the arenas kid fall down to our eighth pick? He might. Oh my God. The Bonsta, the Mon that's not that bad. That's not a bad nickname. You know what? We'll, we'll allow it. I don't think anybody would say it with a straight face, but it works. I mean, we were saying Durantulo for like five years. That's bad in its own. I'll take Chris Washington just because he's the best overall player. I don't think there's not like another Hall of Fame level guy in here, right? Yeah, no, we'll take Chris Washington. Screw it. And Elijah Williams. Easy. 18 over 18 year old. Aren't most NBA nicknames bad? What's the best NBA nickname? I'm trying to think. Maybe that, that's that's the uh, question for the comments today. There you go. You did it for me. The Iceman. The Iceman might be the best one. Round mound of rebound is good but it sounds like something i would say see on 2k like auto generated type of thing you can never go wrong with his airness yes you can be honest who the hell says his airness nobody says that don't lie to yourself and the team is really cut and dry now my god everybody is gone rotationally we just need another shooting guard so just prioritize that we can afford jordan oh snap curry did re just retire we lost all that money off the books it's only three players on the team who make a significant money wait 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 matter of fact 11 million in cap space is there I forgot free agency existed. Hold on. Is there any way if I like lobbed Edwards to like Dawkins got chocolate thunder from Stevie Wonder? That's a fire. That's a fire story. That nickname was getting before I knew that. It might be the best now that I know that. But how did Stevie Wonder watch basketball? So wait, there's two DeBonstas. I just drafted one, right? We were just making that joke and everything. Dang, I have enough money. Wait, RJ Barrett doesn't have an offer yet. He's restricted. How is he restricted? You're 27. 2K forgot to take the restricted off him, didn't they? Even Euro's restricted and he's 27. It doesn't make sense. Is it time to just bring Jordan Poole back though? I think I think I got to do that, man. I, I think it's time. Bring Poole and Wiseman back? I might have to, man. I might have to. I don't think I have the money for all that though we might be dragging it oh and rupert's a free agent what the hell i did not know that you're pretty good why well, say i gotta decline paul uh jordan pool's uh, what's it called a contract i don't want to decline that uh, accept him dang we were talking about i can't trade a rookie buddy buddy hold on hold on don't you remember when andrew wiggins got traded i don't care look you could always bend the rules a little bit i'm not i'm not sitting here restricted by the 2k rules i'm trying to trade this rookie so i could uh so i could sign jordan pool this really this mid one. Oh, yabu Sele? no I, I can't take a player back yeah sure screw it i'll take this clippers one let me see does it work now dick wiseman off here still doesn't work negative 16 how does that even make sense you know what i could sign could i sign pool and wiseman and let uh and let rupert go i could just do that he averaged 17 last season though nah pool is just worse in every way i can't do that I i'll try and finesse it i'll try and finesse it let me try it i think i finessed it i did it i finessed them yep got all of them back screw screw the system beat the system tax evasion i'm actually gonna pull probably play back up two I, he might no he might just play the one he might just play the one trade man you want, actually a yeah, trade man didn't pass you could play a two buddy you're, you're short but you got it and wiseman wasn't even really needed but screw it. Change Wiseman's number. What number did he wear when he was on the Warriors? What five? What did he wear? 40 something, right? Was it? Am I tweaking? 33? It was some ugly. Yeah. Yeah. You could have 33. Trust me. Nobody else wants that number. Oh my God. Chris Washington has the number. Um, He could have 32. Now let's give him a real ugly number. I remember the conversation from the last video. Give him Reggie Miller's number. He does kind of have the Reggie Miller ears. You are right about that. But wait, didn't Reggie Miller wear 33? Or no, he wore 31. You know what? I might do that for you. I'll sign some mid players. Actually, you know what? Sign the best young players we can. 5'11". Man, Wiseman got worse. Wow. Maybe it's just, you know, the Golden State curse. My green for the season. Get back in the game. Oh, never mind. This guy's not getting back in the game. Torn calf muscle. I saw a dude named Petrus. Shout out to Michael Petrus, man. Is McKnight's not even playing. Man, prioritize the young players. We need that guy to play. We also can't have him, like, you know, not being as good because he's not playing. No, I'll put Jordan Poole to two if I have to. Young players. There you go. Jordan Poole, you a seventh man, buddy. Accept the role. We're going a little different. Run the nine-man rotation. Forget Nas Reed. Anthony Edwards already wants to resign. That's what I like to see. Front load that contract, buddy, and accept it. Actually, we need, do we need a new system now that Curry's gone? What's our best system? Oh, it's the same one. All right, screw it. What did, what did Jamal McKnight do? Matter of fact, wait. The, the power forward's starting as well, right? Okay, yeah, AJ DeBons is starting. How they doing their first game? It's telling me to not play him? Screw you. Man, put Jordan Poole as a two. I don't want to see no messages like that ever again. Oh, Chris Watch is not playing? Screw him. He's not good enough yet. I got rings to win. You get all some G League minutes. I already know they're going to bring him back. I'm not even going to send him down there. You know, I'm lying. Run a 10 man and give him Nas Reed's minutes. He'll probably get subbed out in two seconds once an injury happens, but we ball. They got pool starting over Edwards. You know what? We are the Warriors. What do you like best about attending the Knicks games recently? I don't know. It's like euphoria in there, you know? It's like unexplainable. 
loudness. I hope Edwards got injured. And can they get this season over already? What are you talking about? You don't know the story. What do you mean? What story about Julius Randle? I don't even know what you're talking about. The Knicks fans after the Heat eliminated eliminated them, tore up a sign. Yeah, I did see that. Normal New York behavior. I don't understand what's so thoughtful about that. Scoot Henderson wins MVP. Jamal McKnight. Oh, hey, we got rookie of the year. Starting point guard. The Monsters brother when most improved. And Mark Dangle, coach of the year. I thought there was a genuine reason behind his, his sign getting uh, ripped up. I mean, the genuine reason was that he, he shoots 30% in the playoffs. No All-NBA players, but we had number one and two in the rookie of the year race. Hey, man, we're prioritizing the youngins. We are the third seed in the conference, even post Steph Curry. I mean, it's still a good team. It's not like it's rocket science, but Wiseman is awful right now. He has been playing. Why did he start in 23 games? I don't know. Walker Kessler is heated. Yeah, get Wiseman out of the rotation. Throw uh, throw CJ Washington in his minutes. Actually, oh yeah, no. We don't need Trey Mann in there. We got Jordan Poole playing. That'll be fine. Dang, Kuminga isn't starting right now? Nah, we need Kuminga starting, yeah. First round against the Lakers. Post everybody because their whole team is old. AD might still be there. I don't really care. We're up 2-1 and 4-1 series win. Up 2-1 on the Spurs. 2-2. 3-2 in their favor. How's everybody playing now? We have a whole new team scheme going on, so playing pretty mid that's good that's good to know i mean he's getting six assists a game but yeah not the greatest 43 percent from the field from kessler and nas reed i might need to get nas reed out of the rotation too then he's on fire yeah that's a lie why is wiseman oh they they throw wiseman back in there without telling me you know what though he's not playing that bad so i'll leave him any jamal mcknight propaganda no we we got smoked it's only the second year it's all good i, I feel good about this team though going forward six for six from edwards you probably should have shot a little bit more buddy but you know he had a nice little efficient um what kind of game is this is like a Steve Nash type of game. A couple more rebounds. Azamoto was one for seven. Wiseman is awful. I, I got to trade Wiseman. I'm sorry. The troll is over. Jordan Poole, I think, just had a bad playoffs, but Wiseman is actually awful in this game. And Basala Baz Bagayoka, 85 overall finals MVP with the Raptors. He's literally the highest rated player on that team. We, we could have won the... Oh, nope. Jaden Ivey is... Oh, so is Scotty Barnes. He's still... Scotty Barnes is the highest rated player on this team and had the least points in this game out of... Except for Josh Okogie. Oh, dang. Clay just retired? A uh, glitch in the show. Steph, Steph again. Uh, uh, he's got to be somewhere. I guess not. Whatever. We did the clay jersey retirement. We'll all be there, man, in attendance. Change the time the offense is given to advance the ball to the front court to eight seconds. So I changed it early in the video. Now they're changing it back. That's nice. Sudden death rule? No. No. We're not breaking the basketball game like that. Dang, Blazers about to get the first overall pick. No, they didn't. Oh, dang, it went back to uh, the, the truck. What was it? Dallas? Dallas. I'm pretty sure that's the Jazz, which is kind of funny. Again, yet again, another Jazz trade. Hey, uh, Wiseman, Nas Reed, and uh, for Trey, Trey Mann. Let's get Durant on the team. Why not? Jalen Duran. He's averaging 17 points and 10 rebounds, but the Jazz don't want him, and I do. So I was doing some research since this happened to you. Last time a team had the one and two in rookie of the year voting was 1971-72. ABA's Kentucky Colonels. Sorry, that word always throws me off. Who were the players? Um, and it's the ABA. That's kind of crazy. That is, hey, I guess that's the benefit of streaming because that guy just gave us a fact. Middle of this, you were the Colonels. No, 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 chill out. Oh, is Artis Gilmore and Dan Issel? Wow, that is a good two. That is definitely a good two. Be one and two in rookie of the year. Oh, we got pick 15. I'll keep the pick. Draft someone trash. Bryce Curry. Yeah, give me Bryce Curry and his cool name again. We have no free agents at all. 14 players on the roster. That's actually accurate. Yeah, because I straight at a three for two. So no, no free agents. Wiggins. Wiggins, you want to come back? I, I had no hard feelings against you. I just, you know, you were a product of, uh, yeah, the environment, I guess. Wiggins, hold this uh, four-year deal. There you go. Welcome back. Don't really need you, but I guess we do because I said so. Edwards got worse. Pool got worse. What the hell? How did you get that much? You're 20. And I'm probably going to simulate like two or three more years and I'm making no more moves but re-signings, honestly. Just want to see if our little core that we established pretty late into the video can win a ring. If not, then we ball. Kind of have like three separate dynasties here or four or something. I left after he traded for Kessler and he's still rebuilding. I don't think y'all realize. I know. I know. What's it called? I said this in the, the Knicks one that I just did two days ago or whatever yesterday. These always take three to five hours every single one you're, you're just uh you, you just uh, hey this one the, 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 watch this right now i'm saying this in the video probably like 40 minutes to an hour in into the recording right and after the post editing right right now we're three hours in I, that's what that's how it works you know what i'm saying every single time and jesus the team is trash this year and jalen duran cannot stop getting injured it is not dedication uh, it's fine it's, it's not that uh omega welcome back victor mvp oh i forgot about cam boozer i mean i don't know how that's possible dude is always dominant every but solid 
Bug. Oh, okay. He never mind. He's he's about to be back in two seconds. I'm about to say the final MVP is injured though. That's kind of crazy. We are the first seed with 58 wins. Anybody injured right now? Yup. Jamal McKnight is injured for how long? Dislocated left patella for the season. I mean, we got players to step up, but he was our leading scorer in the last year's playoffs. Well, Jordan Poole is now the point guard that needs to carry the team to the promised land. So um, yep, we're in another scenario like that. And we're down 3-1. Lost in the first round. My God. I'll give you one more year, Jordan. Is Basal about it? He did it again. How did Jordan Poole do? Matter of fact, just single him out. 14 on two for eight, seven on two for nine, 11 on three for nine. The other two games weren't that bad. They were pretty good, actually. But my God, thing is, but going to be out for even longer because of the patella. Patellas are pretty serious injury, right? Uh, uh, you might be you might be out for a little bit longer, buddy. I will not trade Jordan Poole. We're going to live and die by Jordan Poole. It's Steph Curry's fake disciple. That isn't definitely not Steph Curry. Edwards went down to what is going on with the players and getting worse when they're not even that old. Okay, Wiggins, you're pretty old. Yeah, you're old. Oh, Jamal's back. That's good. 84 overall. Him and Debonsta leading the team still. I don't know why Kuminga's not starting, but it is what it is. Been on 11-man rotation this season. Get the whole team involved. Having Poole be our franchise player is rough. Well, I mean, yeah. Yeah, it is. I mean, you saw what happened. I mean, I mean he's not the franchise player right now, but hey. I just opened Twitter to a Wendell Carter Jr. highlight film thread. That is... Let me get off my For You page. I need to delete my Twitter account. Jesus, the team is cooking. Dang, I was going to go re-sign Jalen Duran, but never mind. Free agent, my God. Oh, Jordan Poole? Hey, man. Franchise. Jesus, he doesn't even want no money. Uh, that works with me. You know how I, I, you know how I roll. Don't even know why Gary Trent should be here. He doesn't even play, I don't think. But yeah, no, he does actually. Basala, MVP, Victor DPOY. And no players win anything, get any awards, get any anything. But with a first seed, 67 wins. That might be better than throughout at least the simulation we've seen with any team. And Jalen Duran is a oh, hyper extended elbow. You'll be all right, buddy. Screw it. Just see how the team does. McKnight's not injured this year. So maybe that changes things. He's playing 36 minutes per game. Oh, oh okay, cool. I'll take it. First round win, second round win, third round against the Thunder. Very overpowered team but not overpowered to us no maybe, maybe i lied four two we got we got it we're playing the two-time finals champions the raptors basal is a 94 our players are still like developing our young players and he's already a dog marcus johnson screw it just click simulate they won the first one 12 point win we won the second one they won the third one okay i'll sim cast now that we're down three one because i like the edge oh it's still in gilmore one and two in mvp dang that, well, I guess the fact was incorrect. The Raptors got the Warriors again. They won three straight. We have not won three straight. Basala, 94 overall, one of a kind. Dog, three straight finals MVPs. I'll give our team one more year. Just one more. Goodbye, Julius. Jamal's an 89. DeBons is only an 86. What happened? What happened to your ceiling? And Jordan Poole is a 79. I have not seen a, a fall off this crazy at 31. Not even Paul George falls off this crazy at 31 in 2K. Wiggins is 35 and still an 80. He hasn't even gotten injured. Jordan Poole just, he just sucks. I guess. I was about to say, I, I could tell because our rotation was different. Steve Kerr is gone. Can I have a better coach than a C plus, D minus, whatever the hell this guy has though? Like, is there a better coach out there? You know what? Palmer. Palmer's uh, speaking to me right now. Jay Palmer, B plus, seven seconds. I like the seven seconds offense. Oh yeah, wow. Four and a half stars on that offense. Oh, see if Steph is in the coaching pool. I did not even think about that. Either he's somewhere else or he went off and bought himself an island and dipped off from the world, probably. Steph at shot doctor. Yeah, that'd probably be fitting. Would an NBA player be your personal trainer? Whose bag are you taking? That's the thing. You got to be realistic, though, because personal trainer and stealing someone's bag is a little bit different. My first thought was Kyrie, but you can't beat Kyrie. Not even like it's not possible. If you got like Raul Neto, Ricky Rubio, shoot, Johnny Flynn while we're at it, maybe a Shelvin Mack. Like, you know what I'm saying? That's a Akeem Olajuwon. I don't know. I just saw a dude say Akeem. So, yeah, a little bit of a different stratosphere, you know, but um, Walker Kessler refused resign. Why? Why would you refuse resign? Jamal, wow. We have the MVP. What is he at 89? At 91 now? The MVP, most viable player. I'll take it. You know, I feel like that's very rare in a rebuilding video because the teams are too good for this. 58 wins from our coach, rookie coach. Cameron Bruiser broke his leg. We had nobody else on any other team. Kuminga is actually starting at power forward currently. And they put, what's his name on the bench? I get. Oh no, he's got to be injured. The Bonsta's injured. Let's just ball anyways. Clippers, goodbye. Utah, maybe not goodbye. Utah, goodbye. Lakers, goodbye. We're back in the finals. Playing Victor, just cook him. One game, three game. Oh my God, four games. Oh yeah, that's how we leave. I'm not even leaving this screen for the Twitch chat because they asked for it. Obviously, they really care about how my channel does. Um, let me gain. Um, you know, I want seven subscribers gained on this channel by the end of last. Uh, by the end of 2017. And um, and yeah, uh, I hope you have a great um morning. It's been real. It's been fun. It's been real fun. Goodbye. Cut.